Welcome back, everyone. Drake Hawkins with the N, and I just noticed a little note here when I was about to start. In February 14th, 1960, so two days ago, Russia has set Poland as their new rival. That's lovely. Poland, I got some fun for you. You can fight Russia with me. Before we get started, if you're enjoying the series, please hit that like button. It helps me out. And if you haven't already joined the clan, hit the subscribe button and stay tuned for more great content. Uh, we're going to get that started right away. As soon as I just double check on these wars here, I want to go down to the Conquistadors in, Cher in the Cherokee lands. They're 49%. The army down here in uh, Musica. Taking off the Music. Da -da -da -da, in the mountains. I love it. Musica's capital is in the mountains and it is a level 3 fort. So he's holding on nicely. 28% there. Well, we don't need him force marching. That's a little redundant at this stage. Uh, Portuguese Colombia has beat back the attempts of Prussia, the Prussian um, West Indies. To finish that off, there we go. And are we able to end this? I want these to be blitz style, as fast as possible. So clear offers, I want everything of your provinces please right now. Done, 49, take all your cash. And there's nothing left to do there, right? Good, got it. End the war. Boom. Now we just need to core all that stuff, of course. Uh, you can actually hang out in the mountains. That's a lovely spot for you. There are separatists. Are you going to move in? Probably. No, you know what? We'll leave them. They can cause trouble down there all they want. Uh, coring new provinces. Let's do that. 54 costs, really? That's a nice province. How good is that province? How nicely did you build that? Oh, it's a 17. Well done, gentlemen. That is fantastic. Um, let's, yeah, let's core that up. 454 for that. This costs over 100 uh, points. 200 points. Nice. 15. Those are good provinces. Uh, so that will all once core become... Well, that's Caribbean trade now. I did not know that. Uh, that's not what I meant to hit. I meant to hit this. Columbia zone. The trade zone. Or colony zone. That'll all become part of Colombian... Uh, German Columbia? I don't know what they'll be called. Can't have been auto-naming themselves lately. Uh, this group is now formed. This is the... Uh, American Coast Guard? Western Coast Guard. Can we do that? Just need enough space. Ah! Oh, the West Guard. Let's go that. <laughs> West Guard. There you go. The West Guard Fleet. That'll work. Okay, you are now named. And you should have a naval officer, but I don't think so. I don't think we'll prioritize that. I'd love to have a, a navy dude for all of them. That's a little redundant. You can get rid of your leader. You're not uh, required to do all this force marching stuff either. 71% chance of taking the Cherokee capital. That'll be good. And we're going to actually head down and... Oh, no, we're not. Cuba's got it. New Brandenburg and uh, Cuba are taking care of the coast down there. We'll take care of these ones, and that'll end that. Now... Over in Europe, way back in Europe, meanwhile, back in Europe, we have uh, some fleets to deal with here. Let's see about this. I have these three fleets. This is one of my trade fleets. This is another one of my trade fleets. And they are going to come up here. And up here. And this one can come up here. As soon as they arrive, we'll go ahead and get things rolling in... Sweden, new settlement. T gain 10 prestige or base tax. We'll take the base tax, thanks. Love it. What is our current mission again? I forget. We got oh, reduce overextension. No problem. That'll finish on its own. Let's keep the time rolling here. Native assimilation in. Uh, oh, nice. Nuremberg. And that fin should finish off that colony, right? Yep, that did finish that colony. Does that make this a new province? Tariffs and tobacco. Tax it. Sure. Uh, no, no, Augsburg isn't formed yet, and these aren't cored. That one did finish. 
Good, 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 good. We're about to form a colony here. That'll be fantastic. The Portuguese. Interesting. Portuguese are going in after him. Uh, Portuguese West Indies is not doing so well against... Or, um, Prussian West Indies is not doing so well in their war against the Portuguese West Indies. So let's, let's help them out here, I think, soon. After this war, perhaps we go after the Portuguese Colombia. And up here, we finish the capital. It's good. Head down here. Uh, tr protect trade against the... Yeah, fine. Let's go knock these fleets around, shall we? Uh, you know what? I'm going to send you on a hunt enemy fleets in the Caribbean Sea, please. Good. Now, Sweden, are you ready? Is the, are the fleets arrived? Almost. Fleets are almost here. we got four colonies going, and they're going to finish up shortly. Uh, you guys are going to split up and blitz your way through. You're going to come through with a general, please. Yes, you got a general on that coat side. We got no general up on this side. We can probably bring. Nope, here that's breaking the breaking the line. This guy is going to need to be not super stellar. I don't know. Actually, we will bring a super, fairly stellar guy up here, and then you can be the siege bonus guy. And then you, one of you guys should have Gebhard. We don't want Gebhard. We don't want Johan. And we don't want Fernand. We could bring Friedrich. Yeah, that's, that's who we'll have. We'll have Friedrich up there doing it. Good. Okay. Arrived. Fleets have arrived. Let's get this on. Declare war on Russia. I mean, on... They're really close to saying no. Really, really close to saying no. Uh, let's take Viborg. There, one smack in there. You get in here, and you'll decide which side to go, depending on which way they go. There we go. You're going into... It's blockading. You're not going in anywhere, apparently. Okay, fleets move in. Let's go across the water here. Nope, in here. You take Viborg. You've got the triple siege, please. You're going to stack up here. It's got 43 supply limits. So let's go supply limit 60. We'll pop in here. That'll still be an attack. It's worth taking. You guys can come down this way. You are going to split twice. One of you going up there. One of you going up there. Third splitting. Coming in four. And one there. Good. Fleet down, ship taken care of. We have uh, some ships up there, lots of them. Can all of you guys hit here. German occupied. Or German city occupied. I mean, Cherokee city occupied. Can we take all of your turf yet? That and that and that and that. Apparently, New Brandenburg cannot make it a core. Okay. Oh, it's it's occupied by New Brandenburg. Oh, that was silly of you, dude. If you'd have just given it to me, I could have taken it, and then and then I could have given it to you, and it would automatically become yours, wouldn't it? Oh, maybe not. That might be another colony. Okay, uh, that will do. I actually first should see if these guys know they won't. They won't give us any cash. That's fine. Take all their money. What? What? You just... I was just, just able to. <laughs> what, the, what the heck just happened there? Okay. War, and I take this and I choose this. And then I chose this. And then it let me do those. But it wouldn't let me do these two. Weird. Okay, now I have all your money. Alright, that was weird. It kind of buggered out on me. Okay, good. Done. You guys can uh, just chill out in this land. We'll go ahead and core things here. Actually, we'll 
go up here to core things because that would just be a silly long time otherwise. Okay. That can be cored. That can is being cored. That is. No, this cannot be cored. Fabricate claim. Oh, this already became New Brandenburg. I see, I see, I see. Okay, that's fine. Uh, then the Chickasaw. Okay. German Louisiana. Louisiana. Uh, colonial zoning. That is Louisiana. All right. That's fine by me. We'll uh, hit America here, and that'll give some turf to uh, one prov two provinces to the Louisiana purchase. Get it? Yeah, no. uh, and take out the United States next. These provinces can go to Colombia, or, or to the Caribbean, or they can go to... No, they'll go to Eastern American Colony, New Brandenburg. Uh, the Ojibwe, we could attack them. Let's go up this way. That will give us territory in here, Eastern American territory, okay. And we could hit a Cinnaboyne to take turf there. So call your allies, Poland. Yes, please. Please join in. That would be lovely, Poland. I would appreciate it. Is Russia actually at war with us? Looks like they are. Okay, so we're going to just sit on the defensive here on that line. Let's knock out these fleets. Or these, the, this fleet. Oh, look at you. You're going to take a run for it, are you? These boys are bolting. Like, I'm getting the heck out of here. Get out of Dodge. 16 ships, light ships destroyed outright. Fantastic. Okay, so he's actually trying to blockade. Now he can't. Now we can move the troops across to Abel. He's got a 16k there. Where are they headed to? Um, you're heading into... into oh, that's... What? That's weird. Finland was just absorbed. Okay, maybe we can form Finland again. Right, still doing our march. That's good. We're not taking any attrition here. No, good, 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 good. They're heading off to Russia. They'll help there, but they'll have no unit, no area to retreat to. Oh yeah, no, they're not retreating at all. They're heading into Kola. here as well. Denmark. Delayed salaries. All right. Oh, that's Russian troops going up there. What am I thinking? You guys are heading where? Kola. Okay, so we're going to have to join units up here. Siege of Viborg done already. Excellent. Prussia, the Russians are... Oh, they are wanting some turf. Excellent. Okay, so you guys are going to charge... Uh, there's 47,000 units up there, of the Russians. And yeah, we're going to help them. We're going to head up north with this fine fellow, Fer Ferdinand. Because right now it's just the Emperor there. Um, Colony of New Augsburg is finished. Good. German Columbia. Let's call it Venezuela. How do we spell Venezuela? <laughs> hold on, hold on. Let me go spell Venezuela right. I don't know. Does anybody know how to spell Venezuela? That'd be lovely. Be lovely if I knew. I'm just gonna look it up. I just want to make sure it's right because I don't think you can. Uh, don't think you can change your mind after the fact. V e n e z u e u e l a. Venezuela. Excellent. New country. 
A new country. Can you be the new country now? This is uh, Venezuela. Yes, excellent. So, where is where's your borders here, sir? See you, Bo. It's finished. Good. Uh, let's slow down a second. Where where is your country end? That's Venezuela. That's Venezuela. That's Venezuela. Why is all of this Venezuela? But I've not been coring it. Okay. The course didn't end there. Well, that's cool. Uh, okay, let's head up here. Let's look at Portuguese. Um, the Portuguese situation here. This would bring Portugal into the war. There's a lot of colonial colonialisms. I really wish I could help these guys out. You know what? Can we can we grab a leader here? No, nope, cancel. Let's grab a conquistador for him. Yes, and then can I actually get you to conquistador to my vassal? Conditiari, I mean. Oh, I can't rent them out while I'm at war. Okay, but I could rent them out after I finish the Swedish war. That might be something we might want to do. You guys head up to wherever... Where's the capital of this new country? Did we put it there? We did put it there. Okay, good. Let's uh, upgrade this fortress, can I? Castle's already built. I want to upgrade it. Sea battle, seven ships destroyed, good. Uh, colonial self-sustaining, good. Uh, I want to colonize the rest of these to connect them. There, there, there would do it. Let's send them off. Okay, that's set. You guys come up this way. Is Ojibwe ready to be attacked? They are. Head there. You're gonna hopefully keep at least keep his ships at bay in the in the the uh, Caribbean there. Now, uh, what are you guys? Oh, that's the army. That's an army sitting around. That's fine. Um, the Russians will be taken care of with the Polish. We have 50k dudes up here. Are they moving anywhere? They are. They're heading up to Finnmark, which is forest. And if we got there first, that wouldn't be a bad idea. Are you able? You're just about done, right? Yeah. You can force march your way through, please. Mm-hmm. We are going to hit him in time. They're separated out because they're being silly heads. Stack wipe them. Stack wipe the Russians. Blitz them. Blitz, blitz, blitz. Not a stack wipe, but 11,000 infantry dead. They have such a poor setup of troops. It's just atrocious. You guys are going to try to run through and take out some turf, but I think it won't work. We'll hit that fortress. Merchants occupied with lack of uh, worried about lack of protection. Trade efficiency and range reduced or gain in mercantilism lose. Yeah, that sounds fun. No, we'll stay there. We'll just siege it down. Let the uh, colony do its job. Sweden is already at medium stage status for the war readiness. There. There. Please, the allies will take the others. You've already hit there. That's fantastic. You go ahead, actually, and stop there. You guys can... S yeah, you'll finish that up and then let the, the Emperor run around and have his fun. Uh, Friedrich... No, I want Ferdinand. I want you to shut that off. I want... Uh, 
Friedrich to turn on his boots and go take this guy out. Where is he headed? Is he running? He is running. Okay, run, outrun him. Chase him down, sir. Uh, trading in furs has happened to us again. It's a nice thing to have happen. Uh, okay, the one that can stay here. This one can head back home, get his units. And this one should head back home and get his units. Okay. I think we'll take some Finnish territory and hand it off to, uh, um, vassalize them and then hand it off to... Can we hand Swedish territory to them? I'm not sure. If I take everything that's not Swedish and come back for the Finnish, or it's not Finnish, then come back for them? I'm not sure how that will pan out. This is Ferdinand Noel. Good. Come on down to, I don't know, somewhere down here. Yaroslav, I suppose. There's a fortress to be smashed down there. The Russians have lost their main main force already. Germany occupied there. Internal confluence in Astrakhan. Okay, so the emperor should have should be able to catch him. Uh, no, sorry, Ajibway. Germany occupied Nylon. Fine. We have a fortress here we have to take before we can end this, I think. How are we doing down south? This would be a war against the Portuguese, and then there's a giant fleet involved with that. English West Indies is a war with Cuba. That's quite funny. Can I declare war on the English West Indies? England will join. The Pope will not join. France will join. Interesting. We could declare war here to take that territory. And that territory is a colonial Mexico. That would be nice. Let's do that. Bring the Navy down. Where's the Navy? Navy's poking around in the Caribbean here somewhere. Let's head down this way. We will go ahead and do that right away. So who are you at war with? Chimu. Or you're allied with Chimu, rather. Chimu is down here, actually. Nice. Convenient. Uh, I'm going to declare war on you. And then I'm going to run these guys down and take out Chimu. And have you uh, continue what you were doing, actually. You'll go back to hunt enemy fleets in the Caribbean Sea. Because that'll keep him from popping his troops or his fleet around. Uh, in here, we've taken the Cherokee. We're looking our eyes at the United States next. They've got a bunch of st stuff we want. Up here, we're taking out the Ojibwe, and then we'll head off to the Assiniboine. Yep, next. I think these uh, new Brandenburg forces are going to start uh, cleaning things up in here. Once we've got this fort, we can siege the rest of it down and then take care of those guys. Uh, on the eastern front, in eastern Europe here, we have uh, the fleets have ret are returning to their locations. Oh, good. They've actually got to their locations now, it looks like. Yeah, you guys can group up. You're now able to go and protect trade in the English Channel, I think is perfect. And then, oh, there you go. Occupation. And you are waiting on a couple more ships, yes? Are there more ships being built? Yes, there are. There are four or five more ships being built. Six more ships being built. That's a little weird looking. Did we already have some on the way? I guess we did. Antorf, you have one too many ships going, I guess. Let's fix that. Don't queue that up. And who's already going? You can cancel your frigate. Good. That will be... That'll be the ones we need there, I think. Okay, now, what else? I think Sweden is good. We've got Sweden pretty much dealt with. The Emperor is on his way to try to track down this guy. He is just booting it, though. I don't know where he's going to go, like down to here or down to Stockholm or something. I don't know. Go chase him down. 
We'll get there eventually. Uh, see blanket sieging finished here. We're finishing here. You guys cannot make it to Corellia? Yes, you can. Good. Off to Corellia. You are going to head down this way. Good. And this guy can head down towards Moskova. Good. So we're going to just basically kick the Russians out as quickly as possible without uh, just base. I want Finland. I want, I want to take Finland and pro possibly vassalize them. I don't know. Maybe not. We'll see. Um, Diplo points rather than admin points would be lovely to spend. We only had 11 for admin. I would really like to get more, but right now we can't aside from just bumping this guy above a three. Because I don't know that... Yeah, it costs 603 and gain one skill. Hmm. Worth it, I think, but we'll see. But that'll be next episode. We'll continue the Blitz of uh, North America and the Swedish War. So we'll be back for some more fun next episode. Thank you so much for joining me. And as always, we'll see you in game.